Consistent lightweight design, particularly in the cab, engine, and chassis, have placed MAN vehicles ahead of the competition in terms of payload. The examples below serve as evidence of the innovative power of MAN engineers in this respect. In payload intensive industries, 100 kilograms more payload means an overall plus of approximately 1,000 euros per year. Light construction as a concept starts for MAN early on with the body shell of the cab. Using computer simulations, material is used only where needed depending on the load situation. The weight saving concept is completed with intelligent details such as the lighter aluminium frame for the bunks. The new single leaf parabolic spring also means that semi trailer tractors used in long distance transport weigh less than those with the two leaf spring. The front axle stabilizer has been redesigned with a smaller diameter to correspond to this innovation. The dynamic driving behavior when cornering has also been improved by harmonizing the spring characteristics and the stabilizing effect with one another. The trailing arm supports and X control arms are also now designed as cast parts for the TGX and TGS, which reduces the weight from the previous forged version. A lighter and more durable rear axle connection is now used uniformly for all air sprung rear axles in the heavy duty series. The design for the frame structure for all Trucknology series is based on the use of high strength, fine grained structural steel. The strength and toughness of the material means that weight can be reduced in the load bearing backbone while still ensuring a high level of stability under load. A particularly stable frame structure also makes it possible to reduce weight in the supporting frame of the body. Targeted measures were undertaken in the design of the D20 and D26 common rail engine series to guarantee low weight. For example, a lighter, one cylinder air compressor has replaced the air compressor of its predecessor with two cylinders. When directly compared to the previous series, a weight saving of approximately 100 kilograms has been achieved. The dry weight of D20 and D26 common rail engines is even 200 kilograms lower than that of comparable engines of competitors. All of the vehicles in the TGL and TGM series are equipped with the MAN pure diesel system, which means that they no longer need the AdBlue additive. The advantages in lightweight and medium weight short haul and distribution transport are, in addition to the vehicle's independence from the AdBlue infrastructure, its payload advantage of approximately 100 kilograms. For the automated MAN Tipmatic Shift System, the electronic comparison of the gear shift speeds makes it possible to eliminate the synchromesh mechanisms of the main gear shift. This increases cost effectiveness in part through a payload that is approximately 70 kilograms higher than for the comparable manual gearbox. With the switchable MAN hydrodrive front-wheel drive, driving situations that cannot be handled by vehicles equipped solely with the rear-wheel drive can be mastered, thus saving additional time and money. Compared to a 4x4 or 6x6 vehicle with conventional all-wheel drive, the lower system weight of the hydrodrive vehicle produces a payload advantage of 400 kilograms. The MAN Pretarder is an innovative, highly efficient, wear-free primary braking system. The combined system, made up of the EVB, EC engine brake and water retarder, really pays off, particularly in economic terms, in part as a result of its payload which is approximately 64 kilograms more than the oil retarder system. As a result of the existing potential in transport performance and fuel savings, so-called road trains are an interesting option for future transport solutions in the segment between 40 and 60 tons of total weight. MAN is at the forefront in the development of suitable vehicle concepts and solutions.